Hey everyone, it's Grady from Sub Overland, and in this video I'll be doing a quick little walk around of the Suburban behind me. Let's get right into it. So this guy is a 03 Chevy Suburban and uh, it was originally a nine passenger and it's a half ton and it's been a fun build. We've had this thing for quite a long time actually sitting on the lot and it's fun to um, see it go. Um, but yeah, it's going out today. I'll start with, uh, you know, all these Suburbans, you know, this is one that we sourced so we get it and we uh, do all the uh, mechanical. This one, I do remember this one very well because it was giving me trouble. It had some weird lean codes and uh, after all the testing and everything I did, it turned out that it was a fuel pump. So usually a lean code could be, you know, vacuum related, uh, but this one was fuel related and so I finally ran it down and new fuel pump and it's been good to go. Um, and we also do all the suspension. So uh, Bilstein 5100 uh, shocks all around, uh, has the uh, about a two inch lift and uh, 33 inch tires. This has the BFG uh, all terrain, the uh, BF Goodrich all terrain TA. You guys are familiar with these, I'm sure. Very good tires. Um, we don't do these as much as we used to, but um, this one has it and uh, has the little you know like i said the two inch lift um we do all the fluids so we change uh you know transfer case front and rear diff transmission fluid engine oil uh check all the rest of the fluids uh change them if they need it uh, this one got new headlights because these were these housings were broken so we do a lot of that um i'm sure i've done a lot more to this and as far as add-ons uh, this one had got a 12,000-pound winch that we do. It's a hidden winch, so it looks really stock. Uh, I love how these turn out. And then uh, it's got solar sh shower up top by Waterport. Up top here, we've got an offset fan, roof rack. Rome awning and a hundred watt solar panel up there. Let's check out the interior. I'll select to mention this is number 217. So we're in the 200s. People ask us all the time. So that's where we're at. Um, and cubbies. We got cubbies on both sides here on this one. And then this is our uh, skinny platform that we've done. And I think it's about 40 inches, if I remember right. So that's the uh, platform set up here. Uh, no window inserts on this one, I believe. It is a two, sorry, a three passenger. This one has a bench seat. I'll show you here in a sec. And then we've got the uh, fridge and uh, fridge right there. And then EcoFlow next to it. So here's the uh, EcoFlow Max uh, 2000. So it's uh, 200 amp hours 2000 watt hours capacity lithium battery uh, fridge it's all plugged in solar is charging it up and then the ceiling we did the uh, you know wooden ceiling here this one is controlled by the light switch and then there's the, for the fan that one is the uh, original uh, dome light so that one's connected to the dome light so when you open the doors when we have the setting there uh, That's that'll come on up front here. Um, here's our four drive controls. I've You know all these things are four drive. So in case you guys are wondering usually I think I've done maybe two two-wheel drive Suburbans in all the years so 99% are four-wheel drive anything that I source is going to be four-wheel drive uh there's the double din uh, with a backup uh, camera. 
what else? Oh yeah, I remember I, I've redone uh, some blend door actuators here. I was running down also. It's all coming back, guys. So uh, this one's a cloth. So usually on, actually, gosh, I think every single one, nine passenger Suburbans are always cloth. And, and so this is the middle console right there, slash seat. So that opens up. And then uh, cloth, cloth's in good shape. This cloth holds up really well. Here's a look from uh, the front at the back there. So it's a nice little setup for camping. Tons of space with all the room with the second row out. So short, sweet video here. Uh, and again, this 03 has kind of lower miles, 138,000, which is low miles for us. And a bunch of little add-ons. Uh, the winch. What do we have? What? Double din. Solar shower. The awning. I think that's about it for add-ons. But So this has been a fun build. Uh, three passenger up front, which is cool. And then uh, it's got the, you know, it's a, pretty much a summit package. This would, this would be considered our, our custom package because uh, the... The client did have a custom build with the platform and things like that. So, uh, other than that, I think that is about it. If you guys have any questions on this build or um, want to know more information about how you guys can get a Sub Overland or anything, uh, please feel free to comment or message us. Our website is suboverland.com and uh, you can reach us there. And we also do a bunch on Instagram. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, please do. We'd love to have you here. Um, and we'll catch you on the next one.